Welcome back. Let's play some 10 minute games here on Shogi Wars. So, yeah, there's a newer streamer that's been on the block for quite a few months here. Um, I might refer to him more and more because he's been playing a lot on this site. He goes by the name of Oh Hi There. And he recently got to participate in a real-life shogi tournament, um, which is quite exciting. So, um, yeah, well done. It's very, uh, it's a great experience to participate in such things. And so hopefully, um, in some way we can find some inspiration from that. And remember how to play openings and castles and things, and maybe uplift myself and the community? I don't know. We'll see what we can do. So here our opponent is playing the infamous castle. And I don't know how to attack this thing, but we're going to have to figure it out. Um, I can at least prevent this knight from easily joining in. There we go. I've got a castle. Uh, we're going to block the diagonal. And expand this. And yeah, I don't know where my pieces go here. Anaguma makes everything complicated. Somehow. Oh, if I move that, we have some challenges. Um. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure. Hmm. <sighs> Interesting. I should have seen that coming. Um, <laughs> oh, the tactics I consider here. They're not worthy of consideration. All right, we'll just push the pawn. I've lost a pawn here. No big deal. Okay, my opponent concurs in my opinion that that's no big deal that I just lost a pawn. Um, I don't like that my bishop's marooned. Hmm. Okay, this is actually fine. What's the tactic here? Have I missed something absolutely crushing? No? I have not missed something absolutely crushing. What's the idea here? I don't understand it. Oh, okay. There is actually a tactic behind this madness. Um, yeah, the tactics, if I take the pawn, they can drop another pawn and then I don't get to win the rook. Uh, but this way I get to win a rook. 
so we'll do it this way. Yeah, they get my silver. It's no big deal. The problem with playing Anaguma Castle is that you're playing without, you're attacking with only your rook and your pawns. And if you have your wits about you, the bishop participates, but here it's unfortunately not in the game. Just double check that my overlay look decent. Yep, the overlay looks fine. So we'll just continue the game. They will probably take my pawn and then take my silver. And it's fine. Oh, they're thinking. Maybe they're contemplating hitting my rook before this for some reason. I don't know. I guess the rook could come back and take the pawn, and it's more or less the same. Um, they might be considering rook takes gold. And then try to find some way to drop the gold and make some tactics somewhere. Uh, okay. Yeah, that's Nanafu. possible too. Oh no, my bishop's attacked. Whatever will I do? I guess I'll move it. Um, yeah. Not to be too mean. But I just really don't like that castle. Um, it makes analyzing games much more complicated. Uh, perhaps because there's merit to playing it. Merit being that it makes things complicated. <laughs> um... Mm -hmm. Okay, they want to use their bishop to attack my pieces. <sighs> That's annoying. All right. <clears throat> <clears throat> Excuse me. I don't mean to make noises like that, but it's just having some difficulty. Um, I'll just check that the mic is... Yep, mic's on. Nice. Um, Alright. Might as well control this nice long diagonal. Um, let's see, how do I attack with these pieces? Does anybody remember how these pieces move? Hmm. All right, a horse does belong in defense of the, the king. So we'll bring the horse back to defend uh, the king. Oh, that's cool. Nicely spotted. Um, if they want to drop the knight, I'm cool exchanging pieces here. It gives me fewer things to have to read out. Um... All right, they've placed their pieces. Oh, I see they're going to promote here. Um, hmm. Interesting. Yeah, I don't have an easy way to combat that. Go home.
I'll just push here. I'm annoyed that Bishop Takes Gold is actually going to strengthen their castle. So, yeah. Um, hmm. Alright, we'll take two pieces for one. I cut out their goal, their bishop again. All right. Um, do I have enough pieces to sack sack mate just yet? I don't know that I do. Sampun. Oh, uh, I walked into a tactic here. Maybe it's no big deal, though. It's probably a big deal. It's probably a big deal that I let that happen. Um... Interesting. I guess we'll just take this. Uh, okay. What's the opponent's idea? Hmm. I'm not sure. 
Oops, I just want my king over here now. Uh, I don't think I'm going to get that, though. All right, well, that was exciting. <laughs> we have Anaguma versus definitely not Anaguma. Um, we'll see which one is more solid here. I still have to checkmate, though. But, um, yeah, we'll work on it. Oh, they do have that, don't they? Fine. Uh, let's Yeehoo. run away. <sighs> Alright. Hopefully my king survives this, and hopefully I find time to checkmate the opponent. Why am I using that piece? It doesn't matter. Any piece is fine. Why am I not playing obvious moves? Am I trying to make this exciting? I suppose I'm trying to make this exciting. Okay, we don't need this piece. Let's get rid of it. All right, I still don't know how to checkmate. I've got four silvers. Um, all right, surely this must work, right? Ippun. I'm so bad at this. I'm embarrassed. Sanjubio. I am so thoroughly embarrassed. Nijubio. Thanks for the game. Alright, one down, two to go.
Good luck. Taking here is not entirely crazy, but also not necessary. Hmm. Bummer. Would have been nice to have a decisive attack here. Um, but I don't have one. Bummer. Okay. Well... I mean, let's try this. <sighs> really, I guess what I'm aiming for is to get the opponent to tilt. Because uh, the pawn drop itself seems pretty meritless. Um... No. Oh, they have this drop. Okay, fine. So this walks out of a fork. Hmm. It's amazing how resistant this position is to attacks. Um. Hmm. No. Actually, maybe it's fine. Alright, I should just take the damn pawn. Gold takes might have been a... Well, it's amounting to the same thing. But this way I'm forcing a rook trade that I don't want to force. Uh, but the opponent is most cooperative, or so it seems. Um, hmm. 
What a freaking weird position. Yeah, I've played better in other games. Um, let's use the knight, though, since I've gone through the trouble of moving it once. Hmm. Measure once, cut twice. <laughs> the efficient way to cut. Um, measure twice, cut once. Gofun. Oh, right. I forgot about that. Um, well, that's cool. Hmm. It's fine. Whatever. We weren't using these pieces anyway. Ironically, the bishop would be better not on this board than on it. Um, like, none of these tactics work for the opponent now that this bishop is an easy target. <laughs> the 
But the bishop isn't even the real target here. for the game. Two down, one to go. Let's keep going. Good luck. What is going on here? What in tarnation? This is super aggressive on my part. Um, it's only going to become obvious to the opponent in a second here why this is so aggressive. So the opponent has like gone all in on playing opposing rook here without actually moving the rook there. Um, but since they've done that, uh, now suddenly I have this <laughs> attack on the diagonal. Um, hmm. Hmm. All right, I actually block my rook. Hopefully not for too long. Our opponents played a super low castle. I've not done this well. Um, the fact that they jumped the knight, I kind of coerced them into doing it, I guess, with the bishop exchange here, but um, since the knight has jumped, um, oh, what the hell am I doing jumping my knight? I guess I'm trying to prevent a fork. Um, yeah, they played this castle. I've played an attack. Neither of these two really connect with each other in any sensible way. Um, hmm. Oh. No, maybe. No, that gets my bishop trapped. It's not. Hmm. 
<sighs> They're gonna push this pawn. They'll push the pawn again. Okay, the pawn has been pushed. They can drop another pawn. Okay, what was the point? It looks impressive, but what was the purpose? Oh, uh, I can kind of see that, maybe. If they spend time protecting this, I have a fork. Although, the rook can advance to defend against the fork. Um, that's hideous. Ew. Fine, you get my rook. Whatever. It's just a rook. Says the player who obsesses about getting a rook every game. I say it's just a rook. So it's just a rook. Nana <laughs> fun. Okay, we'll remove this attacker. I'm a bit nervous here because a lance and these pieces could do some serious damage. I don't like playing the knight back here, but I don't see an easy alternative. They're still going to drop the lance up here. I still don't have a good answer to it. Because the dragon hits from the side. Uh, yeah. This isn't where I want it to be. <laughs> so, yes indeed. Welcome. This is game three. Yeah, it's super late, mm. but here we are anyway. Yes, yeah, so I see that this uh, streamer, oh hi there, has been just kind of on a roll doing tons and tons of um, content. And I was just trying to think, what can I add to this situation to make things more interesting? Hmm. <laughs> oh, this sucks. <laughs> Wait, if they push the pawn, knight takes is possible. Lance takes, I take back. I'm not instantly dead. Alright. Um. Do I drop my bishop, though? Might that help? Now, let's attack. Ah, uh, yeah, it's true, I've been doing Mahjong most of the time. Um, but Shogi's kind of cool. Yep, so I get hit in the face with this. If I run away, it's no good. So... All right, so tonight we dine in hell. Oh well. Um. Yeah. Well, we'll see. We'll see about that.
We're using the kind of tiles you could play Shogi with. Whether or not we use them correctly, or if I'm using the right ones, who knows. Uh, interesting. This is aggressive. All right, I'll just yield my bishop for this. <sighs> Is there any containing the dragon? Gofun. Maybe. We'll try once. Hmm. Is that a mate threat? Because if that's not a mate threat, uh, then I've got time to do moves like this. <laughs> okay, that's a legal move. Um, wow. Well, here we are. Um, that's a surprising legal move. <laughs> I mean, arguably opening the board this way could be perilous. Um... Could be interesting though. Hmm. 
What a goofy position. Sampun. If I were going all in on an attack, I'd drop the rook here instead. Nifun Sanjubio. Nifu is still a rule. Um, That is threatening, isn't it? I didn't see that threat. Okay. Fine then, we'll try to defend against it. They could just take this and it doesn't change the situation. Other than this is not twice attacked. Ah. Well, maybe it's fine. It's probably not fine. I might need to take this pawn and run. My king doesn't get very far. My king needs to run immediately, if not sooner. It's too late, though. Um, oh my god. Tactics, tactics everywhere. Um... Sanjubio. Nifun. 
20秒10秒。All right, I've become the thing we all hate about Shogi Wars, so, oh well. Uh, we tried. <laughs> I've become the thing that we all hate, though, so that's fine. Three games down? We seem to be doing okay. Obviously, uh, there's a lot I need to practice, a lot I need to learn, but it's still good fun. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. See you next time.